In this video, we are going to learn about Azure external identities. So when you hear this word external identity, what comes to your mind? This could be users or the persons from outside of your organization. It can be a device. It can be a mobile or computer or any other device or different services, which is basically coming outside of your organization. Similar way, in your organization, you also have users, you also have devices, which are opening those applications. You also have different services, which is might be dependent on those applications. So these are the, these are called the external identity. So every device has its identity, every user has its identity. So these are the identities coming outside of your organization. Now, an external identity is anyone or anything outside of your company that could be a person device services etc microsoft entra external id helps you securely connect and interact with these external identities so if a user outside of your company let's say you're working with a vendor right or you are a vendor you're working for another cloud organization you wanted to access their applications so that means you need to have a user account created and then you need to be your user account need to be given access to certain applications. So you as an entity who is outside from the primary organization. So now how do I manage your account? Right. How do I apply the group policies when your pass password should expire? Are you the right person? Are you accessing the application from the right device or not? So all this management behind the scene right, can be done through Microsoft Entra External ID helps you securely connect and interact. What you can do, you can connect and interact with these external identities. Clear. Now let's see the next thing. Now this is your outside organization and your organization. So there could be people like partners, there could be distributors, there could be suppliers, vendors, consumers with whom you have to give access to your application, right? Who is supporting you? So to vendors, right? Other vendors are taking care of your application, taking care of things. So you need to give permission to them to your organization data or an organization applications. And that can be done through the Azure Intra ID right external intra id now there are a couple of key pointers we need to understand about microsoft intra id what are those business to business remember this term b2b we call it business to business so you are a business there's another business who need access to your applications so this b2b collaboration allows external users to sign in using their preferred identity to sign in into the cloud applications these identities will appear as guest users. So whoever is the admin, they can see, okay, these are these many guest users are having access to my applications and these are the access levels given to them. B2B direct connect, business to business direct connect. Now there could be organization who is already using the external organization or business who is already using intra. Microsoft Intra. They are also using, you are also using Microsoft Intra. Now, in that case, how it works. Enable seamless collaboration between two Microsoft Intra organization with a mutual two-way trust. Currently, supports Teams shared channels, allowing external users to work from their own Teams environment. So, external users can work from their own Teams environment. Business to business direct connect users do not appear in your directory because they have their own intra environment where they are managed. They would not appear directly in your directory can be monitored in teams admin center. The third point is business to customer identity management. So there could be external consumers. Let's say you have an external app where external people are using your application, the business uh, consumers are using your application. Let's say I have a um, uh, food delivery app, right? That means I have external consumers and users who are using the food delivery app. Now, how do you manage the identity? They have a credential, they have a device, they have a phone number, they have an email ID signed up. So all this, how do you manage? 
Let's business manage customer access to SaaS apps or custom application using Azure AD B2C business to customer. There is something called Azure Active Directory for business to customer, excluding Microsoft apps. This doesn't include Microsoft apps, your own app, which is external facing. So using Azure AD business to customer, you can manage the identity. Flexible integration. Organization can mix and match these capabilities based on their specific external collaboration needs. Easy guest user management. Microsoft Entra business to business. We saw business to business. Allows inviting guest users across tenants, including those using social identities like Microsoft account. You can have your Google uh, ID or uh, Facebook ID. You know, many applications would allow. Okay, you can sign up using your Google ID, your Facebook ID, uh, all these things, right? So many things can be done through external identities. Access. Um, reviews and re, uh, recertification. Admins or decision makers can periodically review guest access, ensuring only necessary users retain permissions. Unneeded access can be revoked easily. So you get lot many features with the Microsoft Entra ID.